Birmingham Women's Hospital is a really special place. We're one of only two dedicated uh, maternity hospitals in the whole of the UK and we have the fantastic privilege of delivering 8,200 beautiful babies into our hospital every single year, making us the busiest single site maternity unit in the UK. But whilst there's all these very special memories, sadly, um, for some of our parents, not all of them have a happy ending. So I um, suffered an early uh, pregnancy loss um, at, at three months. Um, I had what's called a, a, a missed miscarriage. Um, so although I'd been feeling a, a little bit of pain, I'd assumed that it was just the normal pains you get when you're pregnant. It was my first pregnancy um, and went for my, my three month scam. Uh, only to, to, to be given the news that unfortunately um, on this occasion it wasn't to be uh, and, and there was no heartbeat. Sadly every year there's over 2,000 parents that have suffered a bereavement or grieving and going through the most unimaginable loss. And our environment, whilst we provide the best possible care that we can, it just simply doesn't offer that dignity, that privacy, a place that you can feel you can prepare before you go and step outside into the rest of the world. I remember the being uh, of being in a room when I received the news with pictures and posters of, of, of newborn babies. Um, uh, and I remember absolutely vividly uh, coming out of that room to, to, to continue uh, the, the, the process um, and walking through a waiting room that was full of, of pregnant ladies and, and their, their other halves. Um, and, and that really hit me. Woodland House will be the most beautiful space. It will be away from the hustle and bustle of a busy hospital. It will mean that people don't feel they've got to rush their conversations. They can be together as one whole family and just take as long as they need to savour those very special and precious moments with their baby. So I think bereavement care and services are an area in the NHS that people talk about perhaps less and even more so loss of a baby, uh, whether that be a miscarriage or a stillbirth. And we know we need to do more and better uh, for this group of, of families. But there aren't models to follow in the NHS. In fact, there aren't really models to follow in the world. And so we've had to come up with some new and different concepts if we're going to really make this a reality. And so we've used some of our expertise that we've got around bereavement care, but we've also talked to women and families themselves. And we've used that as the basis to design something very different, very special, very unique, which we hope then will actually set a benchmark for the NHS and hopefully internationally as well, so we can drive up standards for all women and families that sadly lose a baby. When I was looking at the Woodland House Appeal, it was important to me to get involved and important for my team to get involved uh, with, with helping to raise funds because I'm all too aware that I have men and women in my team and all either of those could be impacted by what happens at the Women's Hospital and why the Woodland House Appeal is important. And I want my team to know that we're there supporting such causes because I don't want them to suffer in silence. It's time to break the silence. We need something like Woodland House in this city. So I'd implore all of you to get behind this appeal and put Birmingham on the map for baby loss and bereavement. For any company out there who's thinking about supporting the Woodlands House Appeal, it's such an important thing to do. You know, we've got families who are going through such a horrendous time. They're very vulnerable and through your support, you can just make that experience a little bit easier. I think the importance for me for Woodlands House is that it will, it will create that peaceful environment. Um, it will create a space where you can have a conversation with somebody who's fully trained to be able to have that conversation but in a in a calm space and a calm environment that is designed to be able 
to break the silence and to have these difficult conversations. So I would say to any business, please come on this journey with us. Please help us to support these women and families that are often at the darkest periods in their life. But see it not only as a way of helping women and families in Birmingham, but the way of setting a standard, a new level of care that we will go on to see replicated across the NHS and beyond. And know that you played a role in that. You started something that's part of a much greater and important journey for all women and families.